Hello and welcome back to Lorefan Gaming Plays Dying Light 2. I'm your host Lorefan in this Dying Light 2 view guide. I'll show you all how to turn on the power at the St. Paul Island Metro Station Metro Cathedral. As always, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Do not forget to hit notification bell to be updated and much more. Let's talk about this metro station. You want to go at night. That's very important. Otherwise, something bad's going to get you there during the day. You want UV shrooms, those nice inhalers that heals your immunity because you're going to go through a chemical area. And, of course, healing kits as always. Now, uh, there's a total of five generators. You turn those on, then you're ready to turn on the metro station. So this way you get your free fast travel. So I'm going to go ahead and start this metro station. I'll be back when the power is on at the metro station.
Upon turning on the power at the St. Paul Island Metro Station, you have completed it. Well everyone, this is it for my Dying Light 2 St. Paul Island Metro Station Metro Cathedral video guide. This is Lord Fence signing off. Thanks for watching and have a great day or night. Please stay safe. Please subscribe to my channel for more guides and content like this. If you like what you see, then pick my suggestion on the upper left hand corner of my videos or YouTube suggestions of my videos on the bottom left hand corner. Have a great day or night and stay human.